Hello everybody and happy patch day to you. Uh, Legion is here and the patch is live. With the new patch we have the Darkness Among Us chapter including the new killer which is a band of four killers but it is called Legion, the Legion. And we also have Jeff Johansson, the new survivor and a beautiful new snow top sort of mountain resort map. In this patch as well we have a bunch of changes to the game like an absolute huge amount of changes that I'm not really going to be able to go through but some of the more notable ones are that if you hide in a locker it blocks your aura to the killer. So say if someone hooks someone up with barbecue and chili and you're hiding in a locker the killer will not see you. The diversion pebble now leaves scratch marks where it lands so it's more likely to confuse the killer and a whole host of a ton of other stuff that I can't be bothered to go through. Also on the store we have some brand new stuff. We have the Wicked Wares collection which is here which oh my god I'm so excited for. Look at this. We've got uh, we've got uh, the new Jake which looks absolutely glorious. <laughs> oh I love that a lot. We got the new Meg. We got uh, Jeff skins. We've got Legion skins. We've got the new Hillbilly. Look at this guy. Wow he's looking well, he's looking, he's looking pretty cool. I like it. Look at this guy. Look at this guy. This is an absolute legend. Honestly, Jeff is what I aspire to be in about 10 years. So, uh, Jeff is probably going to become my new main character. I just love the look of him. I think he looks like a great dude. So for Legion, our new killer, we have a bunch of new weapons in the game here. Obviously, he starts off with a stabby knife thing, but then we can upgrade it to, what is this? What even is this? It's a ruler. It's a ruler with spikes in it. Or a karambit, if you want to go seriously CSGO with it. Along with skins we have, oh we got a lot of skins here, we've of course got the default killers which is Julie and Frank, those are our first two basic ones that you get unlocked, but additionally we do have uh, Susie and we also have Joe. Damn, Joe's looking pretty cool although I do not like your big baggy trousers my friend. I'm definitely gonna go for blue hair, that looks amazing, let's grab me some of that and equip that. And for our weapon, I think the Krambit looks pretty nice. Let's grab that. So you can mix and match all of these different skins together, which is kind of cool. Also, this bloody sick set for uh, Adam here. Jesus Christ, looking just like Carlton. Literally is a throwback to Carlton. Uh, you can see that from his little dance he's doing here, the little Carlton dance. Absolutely awesome. I think I'm going to pick this one up too. Screw it. Dead by Daylight gives me a bunch of Auric Cells with each different patch because I'm a Fog Whisperer. So what am I going to do? We're going to spend them. Okay, oh, and the uh, the old map for the spirit. I am using No One Escapes Death, Blood Warden, Nurse's Calling, and Pop Goes the Weasel. Uh, let's see if we can actually chain some attacks together here. This is not going to be the map for it, though. This is such a big, big-ass map. I feel like I need dis uh, distressing on this map to make my terror radius massive, so I'm actually going to be able to chain my attacks nicely. But let's go see if we can find someone to get this started off on. And hopefully, chain it to multiple people. Where are they? Where are they? They're on none of those generators here. Uh-oh. All right. That's not a good start to the game. Honestly, when you don't find someone this early, I feel like I've screwed the game up. I feel like they're just going to jump onto a generator and get them all cracked out before I've got a chance to do shit. This gen? Here we go. We've got some people here. Hello there, ladies! Meg, does your sprint burst beat my frenzy? No! Alright, that's one stab. And let's go chain this across and get a stab on Kate Denson here. Kate Denson! Damn it, you saved your sprint burst, you goddamn demon! Alright, that's fucking annoying. That's fucking annoying. Kate, come here. Alright, so at least we got an injury onto one person, which is nice. I'm coming, Kate. I'll just do a normal stab on Kate. Fuck it, I know that's actually kind of against the Legion power, but seeing as she's there, I'm just gonna do it. We didn't apply the deep wound onto her, but we are saving up our feral frenzy so that we will be able to do a big long frenzy at some point. Kate, you definitely misjudged that my little friend. Alright, that's Kate going on to a hook. I just wish I had barbecue and chili at a decent rank. That would actually change everything. That would make it so much better. Uh, hook anywhere. Hook right there. Alright, we'll use that hook. Yeah, barbecue and chili would make such a huge difference here, but we do not have barbecue. Therefore, life sucks. Alright, up you go Kate. Have a nice hang around. And let's go back down to this end of the map, which is where it seemed all the players were. They were working on that gener- You bastards. Damn survivors. And your goddamn generators. I'm in. Uh, sprint burst again. Lovely. I love it. Oh. Oh, fuck. I'm going to lose this. Damn, dude. All right. Two generators done. Fuck me backwards. This is not- This is not how I wanted it. Meg. Fuck it. Stab Meg. Stab Meg and go through the window. Can we see anyone else's auras? Can't even see where Meg fucking went. 
Weg! No idea. God damn it, this is actually quite confusing. Uh, when you are in the Feral Frenzy mode, you do not see scratch marks, which means that if you don't have perfect vision over the survivor and what direction they're going, it's really quite tricky to actually uh, follow up the attack, which kind of sucks ass. All right, let's go see. No one on this generator. Let's check this one here. A little bit concerned here. Yeah, okay, we've got people. We've got people. We've got Nia. Come here, Nia. All right, get one attack onto her. Then we get an attack onto Kate. And we're going to come over here. We're going to try and get an attack onto whoever this is back here. Can we do it within the timer? Yes. Yes. That's three. All right, that's kind of nice. Oh, and there's the fourth one right there. Let's go in for the fourth. We can attack potentially all four survivors in one. Damn. Damn. Getting all four people injured actually sounds pretty fucking amazing. Meg. Meg. What are you doing, Meg? I think we just try and feral frenzy her here. Okay, that's fine. That breaks my thing, though. Yes, Meg. I'm coming to kill you. Game over, my friend. Game over. Come here. All right, so everyone's injured. So it's going to actually put them at a disadvantage where they're going to be spending quite a lot of the game now healing each other up. So I guess maybe Sloppy Butcher would be incredible with this. Because I'm imagining that Sloppy Butcher's got to go on to it, right? Okay, also they're going to be healing, which means that we're going to be able to see their auras. Down you go, okay. Down you go. All right, maybe Nurse's Calling is going to be nice on this. I think Nurse's Calling could actually be sweet, as it's got the effect that you're able to get multiple people injured within a very small amount of time. I like it. All right, but they are still doing the generators, which worries me. All right, up you go, Kate. And let's go kick this generator here with our Pop Goes the Weasel, just to regress it a little bit. Okay, this is looking, this is feeling pretty good. I'm feeling okay about this. Uh, we do, of course, have our endgame perks, No One Escapes Death and Blood Warden, when we get to the end of the game. I've just seen someone there. We've got a Nia Carlson, who apparently wants to get Feral Frenzied. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. The chase is on, Nia. That's one stab. And let's see, I want to go and attack more people, really, if I can. So I'm running over this way, hoping to see the auras. There we go, there's the auras, my friends. Well, I'm not going to make it there in time. All right, that sucks. I'm not tunneling, Meg, I'm not tunneling. I am going to kill Claudette, though. Claude? Hello? Stab. All right, so that refills the meter and should allow me to see any other survivors around. I'm not seeing them. So we'll just stab her again just to increase the feral frenzy. And let's continue the chase. Let's go this way just to easily outfox her. Maybe, possibly, potentially. Jesus Christ. All right, we found her. We found her. And there goes Meg. Oh, wait a sec. There goes an injured survivor. Hello there, Kate. Yes, it's Legion. And I'm going to stab you. All right, we're going to try and use Feral Frenzy to identify where all the survivors are here. Shit, 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 wrong way, wrong way. Damn it, this map gets a little bit confusing sometimes. And I've lost ah. my Frenzy. All right, not good. All right, where did I knock down Claudette? Over here, right? Claude! There she is. All right, we'll get a hook on Claudette here. Uh, oh, and there's a hook right here. Perfect. What's that, Meg? What's that, Meg? You're going to get on the generator? No, I wouldn't suggest that. I would not suggest that, Meg. Feral Frenzy, Vault! Oh, there she goes. Oh my god, that person actually went down due to uh, the bleed out? Oh, that was so close, Meg. That was so fucking close. Give me another stab here. Here we go, perfect chance. Stab. Okay, now we can take a look around and see if we see anyone else's auras. I do not. So that's good, I guess. Oh, here we go. Here we go, and they're healing up. All right, Nurse's Calling on Legion is actually looking to be freaking sweet. Caitlin, Caitlin, I don't know why I went for that. That was fucking pathetic. All right, not good, not too good, not too positive. But we do still have someone up on the hook and they've done no generators in the last ages, which is sweet. Hello, Meg. I'm coming in with the Feral Frenzy. Yes, yes. Okay, that's unfortunate, but at least we've applied the buff onto her, right? Oh, and that also ate, that's a thing to worth noting, that ate the fatigue duration. We did not get fatigued by getting stunned by that pallet, which I guess is nice. Let's try and go this way. Mag! Oh, Mag, you little shitbag. Okay, another stab on Meg. I should really just be actually killing her, I guess. 
scared. You're going to bleed out, my little friend. But you're wasting enough of my time while doing so. All right, fuck it. We're going back in for the Feral Frenzy. Okay, so that puts you into the stun. I reckon they're working on this generator here. Let's go and let Meg potentially bleed out. They're not working on that. Megan! Fuck. Got him all over the place. All right, last stab. Nice. All right, I think the Meg is dead now. All right, let's give this a kick. I can't believe they've done no generators in the past couple of minutes, though. This is actually very, very beneficial for us. And I think Meg's dead on the hook, which is also beneficial for us. Uh, I'm sorry, Meg. You got in my way. You get in the way of my uh, knives. And you're going to get stabbed. But she's not dead. All right. All right, let's go find survivors. I'm thinking this generator here, they were working on it earlier. Yep, that has been progressed. Let's give it a kick. Have a look behind, as I feel like they've got to be somewhere nearby. But I do not know where. All right, let's go patrol some more gens. This generator's been worked on. Really wish I had an overcharge on right now. That would be kind of cool. They're working on all the generators, honestly. Not my favorite, not my favorite at all. Kind of want to check this one far at the back here as well. Has not been worked on. All right, cool. So we know that the survivors are kind of working in this, gen uh, this area of the map. Okay, survivors, stop everything that you're doing right now and submit yourself to Legion. Let yourself die. Let yourself be swallowed up by Susie. All right, they touched this. No, they have not. All right, so I'm betting that they've healed up and they're all gonna be here in the house here, in the Yamoka house. Oh, Kidoki. Right, Meg just wants to chase, apparently. Hi, Meg. How's it going? All right, that's one. And let's go in for two. And then from here, do we see anyone else? I do not see anyone else. All right, so let's give Nia a stab. And completely lose track of where the fuck everyone has gone. Nia! All right, so Nia is the obsession, so we might be getting de-striked here. I don't really want to get de-striked, but that's just the sad truth of the matter. Strike. Oh, she didn't strike me. Did she miss it? Maybe she saved it? I don't know. But either way, that's good for me. So we're going to go over this way now. Meg's trying to get herself out of the deep wound. She did get herself out of the deep wound. And there she is. Megan. I'm going to get you, Meg. All right, so there we go. They've done a third generator, and Meg is dead on the hook. Ah. That's nice. All right, now we need to use this yeah. to get our momentum up so that we can go and stab the rest of the people. There we go. Man, barbecue and chili would make such a huge difference here. Fuck! One generator left. All right, we do have end game potential though. Who's over here? Who's who's over here? They've already healed up. All right, Meg's dead. Meg's dead. Katie! All right, stab Kate, and we can see that Nia's back here. Beautiful. Uh, and then I guess do we go for Nia again? I don't really know. I don't really know. Uh, but well, let's go give this a kick. Kate should be somewhere around here. And Kate's also got to get out of her deep wound or else she's going to die. So, where? Where did she go to? I don't have a fucking clue. Man, I feel like I really need to stay on people instead of walking away. That was my big mistake there. Ah, hello there, Nia. Oh my god, she just cured herself as well from the men. Yikes. Yikes. All right, Bandus, time to stop being a complete baddie and get some kills here. Hello! Hey, that's Nia. Do we know where anyone else is from that? I do not. Alright, so I've also fucked myself over here because I've lost Nia. Strider would be amazing on this killer. Honestly, Strider... See the blood? Where could she have gone to? Alright, let's go check down here. I feel like all the survivors are going to be on this generator down here. They're not. Dude, I am losing track of these survivors. Not being able to see the scratch marks when you're in Feral Frenzy really fucks you up. Is she in this locker? She's not. All right. Damn, but she is nearly mended. All right, I guess we've got to... I kind of don't want to use my Feral Frenzy. I kind of want to save it so I can actually get some decent stabs. They've got to be on this generator here, though, right? No. Right, well, we're going to have to be relying on No One Escapes Death and Blood Warden here to attempt to get some extra kills because I feel like this generator at the other end of the map here is going to get uh, progressed pretty quickly here. Yep, it's being worked on. 
Hey, Nia, how's it going? Was it just you? No, we got Kate Denson as well. Kate Denson. Stop that sprint bursting. Okay, that's one. And we'll go further near for the number two spot. Yes. Okay, and do we know where the third person is? I cannot see them. All right, so I guess we just go for... Fuck, I've done it again. I feral frenzied. We got no escapes death now. Feral frenzied. And then while looking for the third player, looking for an additional player to stab, I've screwed myself over and uh, lost track of the survivors. Which feels fucking bad. Hello there, Kate, though. Kate's dead. Kate's literally dead. She's gonna die. She's gonna go down as soon as I stop the chase here. Nice. Alright, so that's what you get for interrupting a mend action. That's actually pretty damn cool. Uh, let's get Kate hooked up. I kind of want to wait maybe until the gates are open. Let's hope that they're opening a gate right now. Although I guess she's probably not dead on the hook, so... It's not going to hurt too much if we do hook her before that. In fact, it'll just extend the game a little bit in my favor. Unless she dies on the hook. She's dead on the hook! Shit! Oh! Someone was here. Someone was here. Someone was here. There! Claude! Come to me, my friend! Can we get the four kill with Blood Warden? Yeah! Alright, you're down. Let's pick you up. And I'm really hoping that Nia's going to go for that gate back there on the left. Come on, Nia, go for the gate, go for the gate, go for the gate. You can do it. You can escape. Do it, friend, do it. Shit, I gotta... Do I have a hook here? She's still not opened the gate, she's still not opened the gate. Nia, open the gate, Nia! Damn it. Well, I suppose we're still in the game here, which I guess is interesting. She's not opened the gate still. Hmm, I want to get all four of these people. That would just be awesome. That would be the dream come true. Go on, go in for the save. She let herself die. Claudette. Damn you. Damn you. There's Nia as well. I found you, Nia. I found you. And now you're dead. Maybe you should have escaped or something? Very oh, I need a hook. I guess this hook over here. Hey, a four killer's lesion. Nice. Well, that makes me feel kind of good about myself, actually. I mean, obviously, it was all pretty much down to no one escapes death there at the end, but I can't complain. Off you pop. Off to the entity's realm near. Enjoy. Yeah. I just love this stab. <laughs> yes. All right, GG. No Ed saved the day. Yeah, it did kind of save the day there. I don't like relying on no one escapes death. I kind of prefer to rely on perks that uh, actually take a bit of skill. But, you know what, at this point we don't have every single perk unlocked, so I've just got to use whatever I can use and take advantage of it while I can. we got 67,000 blood points. Mm. Very nice, very nice. Okay, so what do we have here? We had one D-strike, two D-strikes, and we didn't get D-striked once. Yeah, we did it! Savona. Hey, the new map, beautiful. Alright, so I've changed my perk build up a little bit this time. It's a little bit more early game focused. We are using Agitation, Mad Grit, uh, Discordance, and Nurse's Calling. And hopefully we're going to be able to walk around with the survivor on our shoulder. You know what would be great with this combo? Uh, Iron Grasp as well would be real nice. Now the thing about this map is that it's very, very hard to see scratch marks on their own. Just in the snow they just don't show up very well. Yes. Yes, Nia Carlson. How... I was strategically not letting that hit me so that I could then uh, vault over it and it still hit me in the fucking face anyway. Oh, we got two survivors over this way where I shouldn't have gone in. Damn it, I should not have gone into Frenzy there. So if you do cancel Frenzy early, you lose the entire rest of your Frenzy meter. It's not like the Spirit where you can actually, um, where you can actually just save it. It completely depletes it, so it's not a good idea. Anyway, we've got two people at least working over here. Hello there, Dwight. Get a stab onto him. Let us know where everyone else is. We got a survivor over here. Holy shit. Oh, I forgot that I'm using the add on that makes it map wide. David. David? Where's he gone? Fuck. Oh shit. This is not good. This is not good. Not a good start to the game whatsoever. Ah, but there we have our little Dwight sausage.
Dwight! Dwight! Am I gonna have to stab you, friend? We're gonna have to stab Dwight, and we're gonna have to go and stab these people over here. Yo, what's going on, Nia? Let me get the stab. Okay, and then from there we can chain it over here to Ace. Hopefully. Ace, you fucking idiot! Damn it! And then we could also potentially chain it to our fourth survivor, who is a goddamn mile away. Alright, so let's stay in the area of the survivors. Oh my god, Dwight! What are you doing, Dwight? You fucked him! Oh, look at these stabbings, everyone. Alright, let's go after Dwight. Let's go after Dwight. He's gonna. Pa he didn't pallet slam. Alright, that's interesting. No one's gonna body block against Legion, though, I'm pretty sure. And Dwight. Is. His deep wound's ticking down. If he doesn't get safe. He's gonna go down. Dwight, I'm coming to get you. Alright, we had to do that. We had to do that. Alright, let's get Dwight on the second hook here. I really wish some people with body blocks so we can use fucking these, this amazing ability here to just be able to swing like a crazy. Oh shit, there's someone healing right there. Let's maybe stop being a fucking pleb and play the video game. It's showing off about how cool I am and how much I can stab. Yes, the survivors know how much we can stab. Where? Where? I want to get my shit stacked onto people. I don't know where the scratch marks have gone. Alright, so we've got three people over here. Scratches? There, ace. Alright, let's go in for the ace stab. And then use our map-wide ability to go and stab Dwight here. Oh god, Dwight and... Everyone's here! No! My feral frenzy ended! Shit, 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 shit. I wanted to get all four people stabbed. But we might still be able to achieve that. Nia! Alright, there we go. Let's vault this. Oh, and when we vault stuff with this add-on, the super iridescent button, button, we also um, vault pallets and destroy them instantly, which is kind of fucking sweet. Destroy! Oh no, it's while you've... It's while you've affected someone with Feral Frenzy. I remember that now. It's, you've got to actually put Deep Wound onto the character to do that. Ah well, that's fine. That's fine, Dwighty. Let's give you a big old stab up the bum. Here we go. Vault this. Destroy it instantly. And stab him again, just to get the timer going right down. And I saw as well, by using the stab ability, that someone's over here. Someone's somewhere over here. Nia! You gotta try harder than that, my little friend. Alright, Nia's up on the hook. There you go. And let's see if we can catch Dwight. He was over here somewhere. And... He's got to be healing himself. Dwight. Oh. Some shit happening over here. Hello. Oh my god, he got the save up just in time. I could probably have actually gone in for the stab there. I was just trying to play a little bit. Hello, Ace. God. Oh god. Alright, Dwight's given up. Dwight's given up on life. Dwight, you're not dead on the hook, are you? If you are dead on the hook, then maybe... You shouldn't be crouching down in front of the killer. I'm not going to pay you any super special respects here. I'm going to just murder you. Okay, he's not down on the hook. So at this point, Mad Grit and Discord... No, Mad Grit and Agitation, completely useless. Um, but, on the plus side, we're doing fine. We're doing fine. We've got multiple people on the chase, uh, being hooked, being hung up. I didn't mean to do that! Ah! Fucking hell. That was a big... That was a big mistake. Ace. Ace. I right clicked instead of left clicking. Now you must die. Okay. Dwight let himself die. Yeah. Down you go, Acey boy. Okay. Right. Well, we're doing absolutely fine here, I would say, in the grand scheme of things. Discordance is just activated, so we know there's two people. The remaining two people are all over there. I love this perk just for the fact that it enables you to know exactly where everyone is. Like, that is a huge benefit, being able to see that, oh, the last two survivors are over there. It means that you'll never go over somewhere and waste your time looking for ages, because you're going to know where they are. Hello! Okay, so we know that Dwight is over there somewhere. Alright, so we're just going to go in for the... Oh my god, I love that it destroys the... Jesus Christ, Ace disconnects as well. Okay. Interesting. Interesting. 
Go on, Nia. You fucker! Oh, that was actually the play of the century from Nia. But I love that when you get stunned, it does not affect your fatigue. All right, Nia's ice skating. That could actually mean that... What could that mean? That could mean that enduring is going to be a really, really sweet perk on Legion. Because you can get pallet stunned, and it will just cancel the fatigue. You'll actually be back in the chase faster than ever. Come here, little one. Wait, so picking up a survivor also, I suppose it wipes the deep wound. All right, let's see if we can get Nia stabbed, which would then allow us to down. Which would then allow us to see where Ace is. I'm going to have to do this. Wait, did I bring a Mori in this game? I did bring a fucking Mori in. Damn it. Go, 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 go. Fuck. Is this double pallets? Oh, it's double corner and a pallet. All right, I don't like that very much. Let's kick that. Nia. Come here, little rat. I think we're going for the stab here. Fuck me! Oh my god, Nia's actually doing a great job here. She's surfing around like a goddamn Martian. But she's really knocking me on the head with the fucking pallets. Actually pissing me right off. Nia! Quit it! I hear her. Kill. Kill. I mean, they've still got three generators left, so they're not having a particularly good time here. Hello! <laughs> right, so where's the other survivor? They are all the way on the other side of the map. This was definitely a mistake. Oh, it breaks that pallet at least, which is fucking cool. Oh, there's two Nias. That makes a lot more sense. Hello! <laughs> right, so we can... I think we're gonna Mori this Nia if we can find her. There she goes! Alright, Nia, you know what? That's not a very good space to actually Mori you. A little bit lackluster. Um, let's see if we can find the final Nia first. Healing? Are you healing? She's not healing? I'd like to get both of them down. I want to get the four kill, honestly. Uh, let's leave this Nia down on the ground. Let's do a uh, Supreme Virgin Tactics and just leave Nia down and try and find the other one. I don't know where the fuck she is. All right, well, yeah, if we leave her down, then we're actually potentially kind of swaying the game in our favor and forcing Nia to go and save that person. Ah, hello there, my friend. Feral frenzy. It lasts longer than sprint burst, Nia. Stab her once. And she fucking disappears. All right, whatever, fuck it, let's kill this one. You're out of here, Nia, you're out of here. One in the arm, one in the ankle. And one in the heart. And then just disembowel. Oh, they didn't add guts? That sucks. All right, so we've got to find Nia now. Where could she have gone to? Nia. Where have you run off to? Okay, we know where the hatch is. All right, Nia's injured at least, so that does give us a bit of a benefit here. Where are you, girl? Where are you? Shit. Shit. I want to be able to finish this one off with a four kill, if possible. I just need to be able to catch sight of her for a second. And then we're good. And then we're golden. Honestly, whispers would be great right now, because then I would know when I'm within range of her and I could just seek her out and murder her. But at this point, nope. Fruitless. Very fruitless. Uh, where is the basement? That is a good point. Maybe she is in the basement. I don't even know where the basement is in this building. Maybe the basement's not in this building? Could be. Could be. All right, Nia, you're taking the piss now. I bet she's just waiting in the house watching and laughing. It's kind of like a Nia thing to do, right? And she finally did it. She finally escaped. All right, good job. Good job, Nia. Let's give them a GG for that. That was pretty okay. And a smiley face. Although we didn't get many points at all. 25,000 points. Oh, I forgot that I didn't pop a bloody party streamer. Ah, oh, 25 is fine. So the person who escaped did have D-Strike as well. That was alright. I quite liked the iridescent button, which made it so that we could see where the other survivors are. I shouldn't have chased very hard on that. I need to figure that crap out. But I like the fact that pallets get immediately broken when you dash over them. Uh, the mixtape also does a, does a good bit of damage when you do the stab, which sort of helps up the bleed out timer. Uh, and my perks here, Mad Grit didn't do anything, Agitation didn't do anything, Discordance did help me twice, and Nurse's Calling was very useful. This killer is so boring to, to be honest. You are playing Nia. 
Well, that's where I'm gonna wrap it up today, everyone. Thank you so much for watching my Legion adventures today. What do you think of the new killer? If I have to give my opinion, I do feel like they are a little bit weak. But at the end of the day, uh, you can't just keep on bringing out killers that are better than the next. And also, I do feel like people with decent perks and a great set of, you know, unlocked perks and add-ons will actually be able to learn Legion and actually be very powerful with it with some practice. With Definitely with some practice. If you've enjoyed the video, please do leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you are new. Plenty of Dead by Daylight content every single week up on the channel and over on Twitch. Have a lovely day, everyone. Hope you have fun with the new patch and good luck and have fun out there. Panda out.